It's the energy vibration reading for the week number um, 38 and I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here um, thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful positive uh, um, support that you guys bring in um, it is really awesome thank you thank you so much oh yeah I'm back on camera because um, it has been just so much going on and um, I got it um, I really really got it <laughs> Um, get these um, things going because um, I'm sorry I just woke up <laughs> I have to wake myself up basically so um, this week reading sorry mm, it's from the same the um, 17 until the 23rd okay on the 17 until the 23rd and um, we are going to be looking at certain aspects of the birthday reading because the zodiac sign is changing in this week um, as usual um, because we are at the end of uh, the Virgos okay so you um, Virgos we are nearly at the end now so um, it's gonna be changing so um, we are about to deal with the Librans, okay? And uh, that is going to be the end of the month. So that is wonderful because it's fallen in um, the end of the month on the 30, 23rd of September, begin the energy vibration of the Librans, okay? So let's see where the 23rd fall in this week. Um, it's the last, is is Sunday. Okay, so we're still in the zodiac energy of the hurt. So this is wonderful. Um, sorry. Um, I'm loving this. Um, I forget that I'm on camera. I'm loving this because this is going to be um, very positive for you guys. Okay. Now, for you, um, Virgos, um, you are beginning your 2008 birthday okay so we're calling up on the angels and guys to show us what energy is going to come out for you the Virgos who have birthday from the 17 until the 23rd 17 until the 23rd what is coming up for the Virgos who have their birthdays from the 17 until the 23rd for the year 2018 okay year 2020 for the 17th you get the stars so that is going to be um, good for the 17 you have the stars so that is going to be good um, 17 you have the star so that is going to be good okay so whatever is happening for the people who were born on the 17 it's going to be a lucky year very very lucky year in, it, in the overall it is a positive year and the overall it is a positive year whatever the situation is in the overall it is a positive year in the overall especially in love for um, it is a positive year in the overall it is a positive year it is a positive year in the overall it is a positive year okay end of karmatic situations is going to be coming up for a lot of you guys okay um, really end of karmatic situation is going to be happening and coming up for so much of you guys that is uh, um, very very positive okay so this year for you guys is a lot of endings coming in okay a lot of endings are coming in in the year 2018 for you um, Virgos okay a lot of endings a lot of endings still a lot of sad situation that has transpired in your life a lot of endings the situation that has been um, uh, unfair unfair situation a lot of endings the unfair situation things that has uh, happened is 
um, a lot of unfair things and a lot of endings that is coming up for you guys so it's a year of water and it's a year of ending things so your year begins after your birthday so after your birthday you are going to be seeing these transitions that is coming in and this is going to make some changes for a lot of you now for the people who were born on the 17 you have the wheel of fortune <laughs> wheel of fortune that is going to be coming in this wheel of fortune is that for it's going to bring you out of all the difficulties that you have been going through uh, if you create karma for someone else you are going to be receiving that karma so let's say that you create karma for someone else you did something to someone else and um, you're kind of hiding this thing it's gonna come back in the wheel of karma okay the energy of the star is here so the star can be also positive but negative um, for some of you you will overcome a situation especially in a relationship because it's all about relationship for you guys it's just all about the relationship for you guys it's all about the twin flame and the soul flame for the year 2018 for you guys there's a lot of luck that is coming in um, the wheel of fortune and the star is yes whatever you decide to do into this year go for it because it's going to be a very very successful year whatever relationship you decide to go in whatever business situation you decide to go in um, go for it because it's going to be extremely extremely successful as we move forward um, we are looking at the energy for justice for the people who were born on the 18 this is going to be a wonderful year um, be careful um, what you have done or um, what has transpired because um, there is going to be um, like um, it's not going to be in your favor so be careful of uh, um, what you you do okay just just um, in this year if people irritates you or whatever the situation is um, just um, walk away just walk away whatever the situation is just walk away because as you walk away um, from these things and these situation um, you won't get yourself in problems okay some of you um, that has done some injustice it's going to be catching up on you in this year 2018 for the rest there is going to who has nothing to do with the legalities there's going to be a situation balancing out in your life in a very positive way and you're going to be understanding where this is coming from or where this is going okay so um, again um, this is um, pause uh, this is somewhat positive and it could be that justice is coming also for people that was treated what that was treated unfairly um, justice is coming for you okay so that mean um, it's going to be looked at and clear up it's going to be looked at and clear up okay so here we have the energy of the hangman whatever the situation is um, for you guys in this year because everyone gets the energy of the hangman it comes around seven times in your lifetime so um, it's it, it can be a year that you're looking at things you're looking at your relationship that you have with people you're looking at um, um, situation that has been transpiring in your life but this it's, it's can be um, relationship with people this is definitely relationship with people you'll be receiving a lot of um, message you'll be receiving a lot of um, compliments um, this energy is invitation also coming in um, from another person someone wants to connect with you so you will be receiving that sort of a, a situation that is coming in okay and it's very good because um, whenever the energy of the two of cups is really an invitation is someone um, wants you to know how they feel about certain things and situation in your life and it is um, you're going to be receiving message um, from a lot of um, suitors but also for business and relationship okay so it's not only um, for a private life but it's also for um, business and relationship it's also for business and relationship okay as we move forward we have the energy of um, uh, a positive energy uh, 
this is achievement building a strong foundation um, a lot of achievement building a strong foundation this is going to be wonderful because what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring is that a lot of people are going to be receiving message about success um, promotion um, you're being promoted in a positive way um, there is a solution for a situation that has been going on let's say that you left your work and there has been conflicts and that sort of a thing um, you're going to be receiving a message that there is a solution that is coming in where um, um, you can change this whatever that is happening or whatever that is transpiring you can basically change this okay there's a um, it's as if someone is going to be letting you be aware that you can change certain aspects and certain situation okay so um, basically um, it is a year where um, if you're finished off your studies if you're going to be finishing off your studies um, it's going to be wonderful because um, you're going to be very very successful okay you're going to be very very successful so I have to go back and align the energies so for the people who were born on the 17 you're going to be working with um, 10 the wheel of fortune the star and the number 24 the energy of the lovers okay so that is going to basically be what you're working with so write the numbers down 10 17 and 24 24 is 6 17 is 8 okay that is good um, as we go and look at the people who are born under 18 we have the energy of 11 5 and 21 11 5 and 21 so a lot of you are going to be working on duality the, the side of duality a lot of you are going to be working on the side of dualities okay um, so whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring a lot of you are going to be working with dualities so, um, so again it's 11 5 21 and 3 for the people who were born on the 19th we have the energy of 12 which is 3 2 and 27 which is 9 okay so you can also use 27 or 9 27 is 9 okay because in the numerology numerology it, it goes from um, 0 um, till 9 okay for the rest there's nothing else that come after 0 till 9 is the most powerful numbers for the people who were born on 789 twin the 20th um, your energy is going to be four so you're going to be dealing with the angels coming in um, with messages and um, helping you with solutions okay so um, you have four one and 33 so some of you are going to be working with the angel and the ascendance masters in this year it's as if they're going to be coming through and giving you information it's as if you're going to be receiving information that you weren't um, aware of and that sort of a thing and um, that information is going to bring a solution to your problems okay then um, we're moving on and we're looking for um, the energy of uh, the air event. So, for the people who were born on the twenty-first, you have the energy of the air event. Now, the energy of the air event um, is organization, groups of people, and situations. Um, these are hospitals, insurance company, you name it. Whatever it has to do with groups of people. Okay, um, and what is happening here is that justice is going to be coming for you. Justice is going to come. Um, against an, 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 an organization um, it can be um, if you're living in an apartment complex and you have been having conflicts justice is come, going to come against them and um, you are going to be something is going to be happening so that you get out of a contract that you were in and this was a dis deceiving contract that you got in and you reach a point you reach a crossroad where um, you are and you're looking forward to get out of a nasty um, connection with some real low energy people and you're going to do this and it's going to be okay okay it's as if the universe sees that these people situation and where you are is um, 
as um, you know whatever it is with this uh, is as if people start to look at something about um, a place or an institute that you're connected with and uh, they're going to um, justify the situation because you're going to be realizing they're going to be realizing that there has been some deception and justice came up on that organization or institute and you're going to decide to move away and leave the situation okay so it can be happening for a lot of people in a lot of different ways it could be for a hospital it could be for um, um, an apartment complex where you live whatever, whatever the situation is and whatever that is going on um, it could be um, for um, you live in a gated community and uh, um, they have done something of injustice and that sort of a thing and justice is going to come up on them but it is the justice is going to come against the organization and then you're going to decide hey um, somehow something is just going to flow so you get out of whatever that contract is or whatever that situation is okay so um, um, let's um, look you have 5 um, 11 and um, 22 so there's obviously a lot of changes a lot of um, um, decision that you have to make a lot of changes is going to can be coming and a lot of decisions that you have to make as we move forward we have the energy of uh, um, the lovers now the energy of the lovers and the three of Pentacles okay so you guys have 22 11 you're working on duality for the people who were born on the 21st um, this um, 2018 you're going to be working on duality as we look at the people who were born on the 22nd you have the energy of the lovers and you working together there is going to be a lot of positive conversation a lot of positive working together with other people positive connection and positive situation where you're going to be um, connecting with each other um, and you are going to be understanding um, where you are at um, this um, positive um, place in your life okay because there's um, there is going to be a lot a lot of um, a lot of um, posse um, a lot of possibilities a lot of good stuff that is about to come in for you okay energy of the lovers is going to be in this year so you're going to be having a lot of connection with relationship whether in, in business or in work so this is going to be good okay so um, as we look at the situation we have uh, um, the six the three and uh, um, six three and twelve which is another three thirty three so some of you are going to be working with the ascendance masters okay as we look at the year and you guys are going to say yeah but you didn't show me I'm getting so much energy in at, as I'm here it's like I have meditate so I'm receiving everything for the day that is about to come okay so that's for your year and um, let's look at the people who were born on the 23rd you have the energy of the chariot which is positive and the, and the end of a situation you have victoriously come through a situation you have victoriously come through a situation whatever that was happening whatever that was transpiring you have, have victoriously come through a situation and here you're going to be seen and understanding this is the end of a situation in your life the end of a karmatic situation you have overcome the situation in full circle so this is a positive year where you have overcome um, and there you can see you're moving forward some of you have overcome a situation some of you are going to be moving it's as if things are going to start happening for you it's as if the world is going to start opening up for you and the end to a karmatic situation is here and it is a very positive ending because wonderful situation is about to come in your life okay it was really a karmatic situation it was uh, you have gone through so much injustice um, in your life and finally um, this situation 
finally final this situation as uh, ended okay finally final this situation as ended and here you have a positive situation because a lot of you have been dealing with situations in your life and you're moving out of that because it's coming to an end and it was a really a karmatic situation okay so let's see um, what is going to be happening so on the 23rd so you Librans because you Librans have the energy of the chariot um, congratulations happy birthday to each and every person and congratulations to the Librans you Librans have been coming out a very bad cycle so for the Librans oh my I know someone that was born on the 23rd for um, um, you know Oh, um, you're coming out of a really horrible cycle that you have gone through for nine years to seven years, and this is good for you, Librans. Okay, um, so okay, um, you Librans have seven, twenty-one, which is three, and thirty-six, and nine. Okay, so that's a lot of numbers to work with, but this is very good because you have. All these numbers so it's going to be good the first card is for the wiki ball and this is for the Virgos the people who were born from the 17 until the 20 22nd this is the wiki ball this is a, um, a positive energy so, so let's first look at the Virgos and I love you Virgos so much because I have Virgo Sun Moon and Rising sign and I can so connect with the Virgos and um, it was a wonderful um, period um, a lot of things happened um, the wiki ball Psst. just so you know a wiki ball is not necessary a sign of destruction it's it's more like a blessing a blessed invitation um, for um, a brand new exciting things is coming towards you all you need to do is to change your perception let's get this um, restart and reconnected okay so this is the energy of the wiki ball is so it says that is the tower it's where um, things decided um, to uh, that whatever um, negative things decide to just break up and fall down and then you're going to be seeing this happening okay and there is that means there is a transition that is coming in your life so that is basically what that is it's just like the energy of the tower where there is clearing you need to let go or move and most of the time when the tower energy comes is that your guides and angels have been saying it to you and you haven't listened to them and that's what happened jackpot so it's really a jackpot for um, you liberals the people who were born on the 23rd um, job part and they're saying that the energy is for everyone in this week um, first there's going to be an end to something and then a, a real destruction a fast coming into something because you have the energy of the um, debt in this year but then after that um, after that uh, um, wiki ball effect because you have debt and the wiki ball now with debt and the wiki wiki ball that means something is just going to um, um, like a disaster come down crash down on you and uh, and then a new start is going to be happening but it, it you know these two have uh, to take place these two have to take place because you are in um, the end of a transition in your life okay so these two have to take place before the jackpot will come in okay so um, this is this is um, basically um, really wonderful doing this reverse this is wonderful because what this is saying is that this year for you guys it, it has to happen this huge explosion or this huge thing has to happen so that um, you can um, move forward in your life okay I'm loving this for you guys it's going to be a wonderful year it's going to be a positive year um, the numbers that are here for you guys because I'm seeing there was as some of you there was a blockage whatever you're doing especially the people who were born on the 17 the 17 
17 and um uh, 17 the 22nd of the 23rd it's gonna be a very very positive year okay an extreme positive year I want to say to you guys um, wishing you um, wonderful positive experience in your life namaste until next time